Hello, everyone. This is Linda Drummond with Network in Action. And today I have the honor of speaking with Kath Nab. How are you doing today? I'm doing very well. Thank you very much. Great. So, Kath, let's tell everybody your company name and what it is that you do. I, I go by my own name, Nab Consulting. I'm a certified franchise consultant. I help people research franchise concepts to find a right fit for them. And I'm also an owner of Network in Action. I own two groups in the Memphis area and an actual one that's got a franchise twist to it. Wow. So, Kat, tell me, how did you get into the franchise ownership career? Sure. I was about 30 years into my career helping corporations save a ton of man hours through the years and lots and lots of money. And I was working in the hospital industry when COVID happened. And I saw choices being taken away and I kept thinking somebody ought to do something. And about that time I was reasoning that people who were their own business owners, they were making um, choices, independent choices for their families that people in the workplace didn't feel empowered to do. And right about that time, somebody called me and offered to educate me about franchise. And when they said the word franchise, I thought, duh, there's a formula out there. I didn't have to reinvent the wheel. They weren't asking for my social security number. So I thought I can learn. And as I learned about that, I was watching what they were doing with me. They were educating me, mentoring me, taking me through the project of research. I had done plenty of project management through the years. Uh, had to be drawn on the analytics of having studied all the brands in his portfolio. So I thought, hmm, I'm going to do that. So I started looking into what it would take to be a franchise consultant. I actually went with a competitor of that, that one company and um, started doing franchise consulting in early 2022. And as I got to know the brands, that's how I came across Network in Action. And I thought, wow, this is a fantastic way for business owners and business reps to really dig in and get to know one another because the format of NIA is so wonderful uh, in, for, in terms of being interactive, giving people the space and time to get to know each other during the networking meeting. I thought this is a great way to empower those people who are already in business. So get people into business, help those who are already in business be stronger and more successful. That's what I'm about. That's wonderful. So, Kath, I know that you've been doing this for a while. Mm -hmm. So I suspect you have a success story. Would you be willing to share one with us? Sure. One of the, I would say one of the happiest ones uh, was a family that, that I met here in the Memphis area. And after getting to meet them on the phone, the first initial meeting, we decided to go to breakfast together. And... It was a Colombian restaurant a few miles from where I live. And so we walked away smelling like Colombian breakfast, but it was good. And I had um, some clients. And so uh, over, it actually took two or three months because they were going through several different uh, views of what they wanted their life to look like. And they had children who were growing up and becoming teenagers. They would be involved in the business. So we finally ended up um, placing them in a ice cream pops uh, brand. So now they're the happiness hustlers and uh, their brand is called Frios. And so recently they were even at my own church's um, summit conference that took place and they were handing out wonderful pops all around, making people happy. On the membership side, I have seen members join and uh, hit it off straight away with other new people that they've met and be able to take off running with um, new relationships. And that's always very gratifying to see, to see new members connect in a meaningful way and begin to, uh, sometimes it's not a client situation, but a referral partner, which I think is all the more valuable than uh, one single new client. Absolutely. Boy, that is success. Congratulations on Thank that. You. So, Kath, 
why don't you tell me, what would you consider good referrals for you, one, on the NAB consulting side, but then on the network and action side also? Sure. On the franchise consulting, I like to work with people who are trying to position themselves for a period of transition. Maybe it's somebody in the corporate world where there's layoffs happening. Um, people, younger people are beginning to get promoted above them. And so I want to take those people and, and get them ready for making a planned transition. This also works well for people coming out of the military. And then for those people who already have businesses, then if they want to stack vertically without having to go further and further distance to gain new clients, then I can help them strategically stack complementary businesses so that they leverage the same clients or um, it can help them draw additional business in from other parties that haven't been clients before. So I try to make it as, as complimentary as possible. On the networking side, I really like people who, with the go-give attitude. So if they don't have that, then um, I'm happy to be help them find good places to network, but they're not going to be givers in my own group. So I want people who have that go-give attitude, uh, who are interested in making the other members of the group as successful as possible. And I'm going to give them as many avenues to do that as I can. Uh, so right now I'm looking for uh, digital marketers and uh, a couple of accountants. And then also I am looking for commercial real estate. And those would be good drills to fill right now. Hey, I wish you the best of luck with that. Thank you. Now, Cass, when mm -hmm. you are not helping people find the perfect franchise or find the perfect clients through your networking, what do you like to do for fun? I like road trips. And by road trips, I mean listening to what I want to listen to. And if I see a brown sign that says something exciting over here, then I want to go and check it out. So in times past, that has included like the centermost point of the hemisphere um, that has, in, uh, sorry, but it, I think it was actually in the, uh, the United States, center point of the United States. Um, then also a pearl button museum, if you can imagine that. I found a pearl button museum. That was very fascinating. And so uh, Christmas that year, I had stocking stuffers that were made of pearl buttons. I love it. That sounds like fun. Yeah. Anywhere where the dog can go, that's that's what we can do. There you go. And finally, Kath, if somebody is interested in maybe looking into franchise ownership or just working with you on building their own businesses, how can they reach out to you? Perfect. Um, they can reach out to me through my phone number, 662-910-7999. Or my email address, C-A-T-H, at nab, K-N-A-B-B, -B, consulting.com. Um, I've made it easy by just going CFO, N-I-A.com, and that redirects to my NAB consulting website. And Maybe if they heard, that yes. jumps people off to N-I-A. Uh, you froze for a minute. Okay. You can, Would you start again with, you can reach me at, because that's where it stopped. So if you'll okay. start. Okay. You can reach me by phone at 662-910-7999. That also works for text or my email, C-A-T-H at nabconsulting.com, K-N-A-B-B. -B. Wonderful. It has been such a pleasure speaking with you, Kath. I wish you the best of luck in Thank all you. of your endeavors, and I look forward to seeing you sometime soon. Thank you, Miss Linda. You have a great day. You too.